So, uh, crazy willies. Hey, Ricky, I, uh, I got a favor to ask. Yeah, what's up, Deke? Um, it's about Boozer's arm. Uh, I saw that hook that you made for him, and, uh, it's great, but, uh, don't you think it might be better if, instead of a hook, I don't know, maybe with something like a knife or a blade or something, you know? Uh, oh, oh, hold on. Oh, thank you. So, oh. who... I'm sorry about that. So, uh, you... You want me to... You want me to create a prosthetic blade for Boozer? Well, yeah, I just thought I might cheer him up, make him feel, you know, more of a... You want me to weaponize Boozer? Well, I wouldn't put it that way. I'm just fucking with you, Deke. I think uh, it's a great idea. Uh, I will go check some parts, and I will radio what I need. Cool? Okay. Okay. That's all I got for now. See ya. I was in my classroom when stay-at-home moms and high school dropouts. Anyway, uh, we heard all this screaming. Thought it was a shooting at first. But, geez, freaks. That's all I got today. I'm just gonna grab some shot eye. <sighs> that should do it.
Heya. How's it going? Hey, how's it going? Uh, yep. See you around. Uh, hold on, I'll get this. Stop by when I can. Peeking out. Boozer, you there? Yeah, dude. I just got off work. I got this many fucking of shit. Jesus, goddamn schizo. Someone killed a deer, brought us the carcass. Uh, hold on a second. I'll get it. Bye.
someone killed a deer, brought us the carcass. So, let me get the gate. into it. It takes time. Just don't get your hopes up. That's all I'm saying. Well. Hey, Deke. I got a good one for you. Mike, hey. What's up? Ricky handed me a shopping list. He said it was from Boozer. He said I should radio you. Where's Ricky? Something came up with Andy, I don't ask. Anyway, she needs a galvanized metal pipe. Kind used in building. She needs a carbon alloy blade, the kind hunters use, and finally some metal scrap. That does make any sense to you? Uh, yeah, Mike, like you said, I don't ask. <laughs> Deacon out. Okay, what do I need? I need a blade or a metal tube. Scrap. Here, here. Ah, Jesus, really. Metal tube. Not, I can't just be any metal tube, can I? Got to find one from the construction site. Wait, wait. What? There's a house um, under construction at Marion Forks. Bet I can find something there. left. Okay. and thieves, the lot of you. How many people you killed today, huh? Should have seen that coming. Take these. Crap, somebody's trapped. They gotta help. Help! Hey! Hey, help! 
Hold on, hold on, I'm coming. Hey, hey, it's not safe out here in the shit. I know where there's a camp that... Camp? Yeah, yeah, where? Uh, sh show me, where? I I'll go, I'll go. Head to Lost Lake, ask for Ricky Patel, she'll take you in. Oh, man, I, I was done for, holy shit. You know, thank you so much, oh man. Tell them it was Deacon, they'll know. Stay off the main roads, don't stop. Deacon, how you been? Last time. Ran into a pack. What do you need? I was on this crappy fight. Okay, man. Hey, drop by next time. Deacon, hey. hey, Damon. How's life? That's all I got. This smells like rotten eggs. Good to see you again. Jazzy, how's it going? Let me get the gate for you. Look, I'm on my way off to separation. I know Cope says there's a ripper camp up there. Rippers? 
This far north? Yeah, Boozer. What the hell's going on with these guys? Alki said the Rippers were looking for us. That we had a price on our head. What the hell? How's that possible? I mean, sure, I've, I've killed my share of crazy bastards, but I never went out of my way. Not that I remember. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, rippers. Deacon out. Assholes, what are you doing? to move!
Reload, reload. Cope, it's done. The rivers up here won't bother anyone ever again. Oh, St. John, that's good news. I talked to Manny the other day. And the others. I know you've been doing things for the can. I just want to say thank you. I'm Cope without. Scrap. Find that Ripper camp? Yeah, Boozer, I found it. You think? You think they were up here looking for us? I don't know, Booze Man. I was too busy stopping them from cutting my eyes out to ask. Sorry, brother. I wish I'd been there. Sure, man. Yeah, I know. Deacon out. Copeland, yeah, yeah, I'm here. I'm uh, guessing you uh, got another job for me. Okay, I'll swing by. Deacon up. No, no, no. Oh, sniper. Shit. Perfect time. That asshole, I guess you won't be ambushing anyone else today.
be back. That'll do. Where are you? Okay. Bounty. Wait, 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 where, where was that sporting goods store? Okay, let's take a look around. Okay, let's see what's going on here. <laughs> Still got this. No, not this way.
That should be it. It's like Boozer says, I hear a bunk calling my name. Ready to go back at it. <clears throat> oh, I'm just gonna close my eyes for a bit. Okay, let's go. Sometime. He shot me. Open the gate. 
I know him. Let him in. How's it going? Think we had a pretty What's good going on, Blair? Um, okay. Yeah, good. Uh, good choice. Okay. Not realizing that they were just as bad. Hey, see ya. Hey. Hey. I got those parts that you were asked for. Oh, great. Well, uh, check back in a few. I'll see what I can do, yeah? Uh, Ricky. Thanks. Yeah. Boozer's one of us now. Here for your bar. Mike? Hey, how's it going? Looking for anything in particular? That's a good piece. Nice and sturdy. Yeah, good part that one. Sure. All right. All right. Hey, man. Just looking around. Me and a couple of guys burned out in a nest a few weeks back. Uh, hold on. Hey, DQ there. I've got Boozer's new prosthetic ready. I asked Addy to find him and send him over. Uh, great. Great, Ricky. I'll, I'll be right there. Deacon out. Right in the okay. crease there. Okay, got it. Let me secure it in, okay? There you go, that's better. Okay. Hey, brother. Look what oh. Ricky did. What? Made me a new toy. Oh, it was old Deacon. <laughs> oh, that's he really, really cool, Boozer. Hey, uh, I could have been one of those, yeah. those three goddamn musketeers. On guard, you <laughs> fucking <laughs> ripper. Right. Pretty cool. Oh, hey. Jesus. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, uh, maybe hey. this wasn't that good of an idea? God maybe. Damn it. Okay.
So uh, a couple months ago, we were up by Crazy Willie's. St. John, you there? It's O'Brien. Hold on. O'Brien, I'm sick of doing your dirty work. You got news for me or not? Yeah, I, I mean, yes, I have news. Well, then what is it? I need you to do one last job. Were you listening to what I was just saying? I'm done with one this. One more job, then I'll meet you in person, show you what I got. Forget it. Her middle name. It was Irene, right? Sarah Irene Whitaker. It's on her admission form. One last job. One last job. I sent you the coordinates. O'Brien out. Hey, hey. You're headed somewhere in a hurry? Yeah. You remember that Nero bastard I told you about, mm -hmm. O'Brien? Well, it looks like he's got some news for me, but I gotta do one last job for him first. Yeah. Okay. You should come with me. Yeah? Nah, I... Skizzle's got me on farm duty. Feeding the world one shitty weed at a time. Fuck Skizzle, I'll drop you off right afterward. When's the last time you saw a helicopter? I tell him he twisted my arm. Never gets old, <laughs> does it? Where are we headed? Over toward Malakwa Lake. You know where that is? Yeah, it's just north of the Rogue Tunnel off uh, Waldo Road. So what are we doing there? Nero Chopper's gonna be on the ground doing whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So, O'Brien, he's, uh, he's what? Your, your shot caller? Handler? No! Jesus, Boozer, you know why the hell we're out here. Just asking. Seems like he tells you to jump, you ask how high. It's not how it is. So how you holding up? Not bad. Uh, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind working the farm, pulling weeds and shit. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at, uh, by Adrian, on the Idaho border. Spend summers working the beet fields. Yeah, a little dirt bike I took around on. That's where I learned to ride. If you're not careful, I'm gonna start calling you Farmer Bill. When we get to that site, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Where are we headed? I was in my classroom. Over one. toward Malakwa Lake. You know where that is? Yeah, it's just north of the Rogue Tunnel. There. A Nero chopper's gonna be on the ground doing whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So O'Brien, he's uh, he's what? You're no, Boozer. You know why the hell we're out here? Just asking. Seems like he tells you to jump. You ask how high. 
Not how it is. So how you holding up? Not bad. Uh, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind working the farm, pulling weeds and shit. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at uh, by Adrian on the Idaho border. I'd spend summers working the beet fields. Yeah, a little dirt bike I tooled around on. That's where I learned to ride. If you're not careful, I'm gonna start calling you Farmer Bill. When we get to that site, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Okay, okay, got it. Stay down, keep my mouth shut, don't get us killed. Hey, thanks for bringing me along, Deke. It's good to get out again. Even riding bitch, you know? <laughs> okay, stay close. Clear. Right behind you. All clear. I haven't heard yep. that for a while. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. Jesus. Never thought I'd see one of those again. In the air, I mean. All right, now watch. Soldiers come out first, they secure the LZ. And their boy genius, researcher, scientist, whatever the hell, he comes out, he looks around. Do what? Whatever science shit they're doing out here, how the hell would I know? Okay, wait here. No. We're picking up scat samples. <laughs> you mean shit? Yes. Freak shit? Yes. <laughs> so, we're out here in the middle of nowhere. So, you can pick up freak shit. Precisely. <laughs> okay. Enough said. Field note 2102. Analysis of scat samples from zones 2, 3, and 4B. There is clear evidence of Claytonia perfoliata. What's that? Commonly known as miner's lettuce. <laughs> Please don't interrupt. <laughs> as well as manicious berries from Juniperus communis. So, why do we care? Why do we care? Because it means the freaks are eating more than just us and each other. They're eating berries, plants, grass, needles, basically anything a deer would eat. Omnivores, just like us, but with stomachs that can digest a much wider range of cellulose. Yeah, okay. And um, what? It means they're not gonna starve when they run out of us to eat. The freaks aren't going away anytime soon. Shit, that's bad. Yeah, that's bad. I'm done here. Okay. Uh, head back to the bike. I saw something. You catch any of that over my radio? That's pretty fucked up. Good taxpayer money and they're out here collecting freaker shit. Yeah, I told you. Who knows what they're doing, or why. 
Oh, they gotta have a base around here somewhere, right? You try following them? Yeah, but they always disappear over the mountains heading south. And with the highway choked off, I can never get close. Sons of bitches. Seems like they got a lot to answer for. Yeah. Where are we headed now? It's a good question. O'Brien, are you there? Come in, O'Brien. I'm here. Finished? Yeah, it's done. Where am I meeting you? I wasn't expecting you so soon. I'm sending you the coordinates now, but it might take a few minutes to get there. O'Brien out. Jesus, what the hell does he think I've been doing out here? Hey, you're right about one thing. He does sound like an asshole. Wait here. I don't want him getting skittish because I brought someone along. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the bike. I've seen enough Nero assholes for one day. Okay, I'll be back. O'Brien said he had news. He knew her middle name, Irene. She can't be alive. But he's alive. Why not her, huh? There he is. Yo. Shit. Gotta stop doing that. What you got? All right, look. I'm gonna lay it out for you, but it's not good news. I finally found a guy who was willing to do some digging through some files that we, they, they used to keep while they still kept records. Okay, no problem. Anyway, uh, Sarah Whitaker, your wife, was admitted to the Camp Mash unit on the South Flats outside of Silver Lake. Uh, according to the records, she was in surgery for six hours and then was moved okay, to... So she survived. The stab wound, she survived. Yeah, yeah. According to the records, she made a full recovery, and then she was moved to another camp on the outskirts okay, of the Okay, so, so she could still be alive, even after all this time. She could still be alive. You're saying no. What do you mean no? It was overrun. Everything was overrun. There were no survivors. You survived. They survived. Look, 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 there was nothing that would have protected that camp, okay? Highway 97 w w is an artery. Infected freaks poured up from L.A., from the Bay Area, from Sacramento. There were thousands and thousands and thousands of them. There was, there was nothing we could do. I get it. So you bugged out. Who did you bring with you? Uh, Nero personnel. Some feds. People with clearance. Nero personnel. The soldiers. The guys with the guns. The guys who should have been protecting no, no, the there, civilians. There's nothing that you can do against a horde. Oh, They're no, too strong. I know all They're too about fast. hordes. Oh, they right. knew that there was nothing that we could do. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have brought a few of them with you. You could have saved a few lives. <laughs> there was no hope. There was no time. There was no room. Okay, we had already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. No, I get it. I'm sorry about your wife. I'm sorry about all of this. But you gotta understand, if you hadn't sent her with me that night, she would've been dead the next morning. You did the right thing. You know, if you had decided to stay, the only thing that would have happened is you'd be dead right alongside her. Don't you think I know that? <laughs> O'Brien. Thank you for saving her life that night. So you're sorry. Is that it, O'Brien? You're sorry? Oh, damn it. All things a waste of my goddamn time.
the hell, Boozer? Boozer? Oh, God damn it, Booze, man. Where the hell did you go? Ah, shit. Booze, man, where the hell did you go? Book tracks. It's gotta be his. You gotta take a closer look. What the hell is this? All right, where? Uh, this way. Still there? This is Ricky. Deacon St. John. Uh, yeah, Ricky, I'm here. What's up? Schizo's been asking for you. Said Boozer never showed up for his work duty. I, I was worried. No, look, we're fine. We just had some stuff that we needed to get done. Tell Schizo we'll be back in an hour. Okay. Hey, I'm almost ready to head back out there and fix that transformer. You still in? Uh, yeah. Yeah, just the... Great, let me know when. I can feel that hot water now. I'm gonna let that shower run forever. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's that it sounds great. Listen, uh, Ricky, I, I gotta go. All right, Deacon out. We're gonna do a little shopping while we were out, and I ran into a pack of rippers hunting dogs. Oh, easy, fella. He's not infected. He's, shit, he's just a dog. They're hunting down and killing healthy dogs. No, just no, we can't. We can't leave him here, Deke. We just we can't. We can't do it. Here, here. Let me let me do it. Really. You can... Okay, boy. Okay, you see, it's okay. All right, just... Oh, listen. Jesus, Dick. God damn it. It's okay. okay, just... That's it. All right. It's okay, big guy. Rest. Are you okay? Yeah. I think that's the last of them. Oh, you sound disappointed. I just... I hate those sons of bitches, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, come on. Let's, uh... Let's get the hell out of here. So what the hell happened back there? You seem sort of, I don't know, like, uh, like you lost it. Uh, I don't know. I guess I just, I needed some payback for this shit. But, uh, there's never gonna be enough payback, is there? You know?
If you had made this shift for me, my arm, I mean, I don't know where I'd be. I, mean, I guess I'd... You know. You know. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, not like I got a choice. Not like any of this thing, right? Yeah, okay, come on. Hey, how'd it go? Oh, uh, what go? You know, goddamn well, your guy in the spacesuit, what'd he say? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. Hey, come on, goddammit. <sighs> Boozer, you really don't want to be doing that right now. Oh, yeah? You think I need more than this to take down your scrying little ass? Come on, what'd he say? Drop it. Seriously, what happened to Sarah? Huh? Where's your old lady? Where's your old lady? Huh? <laughs> Stay down, brother. <laughs> Had enough? Where's your old lady, Deke? She's dead, Boozer. Sarah's dead. Yeah, and she's been dead a long time. So don't you think that you've mourned her long enough? <laughs> I think. I think that you have a hell of a left hook, asshole. Oh. Yeah, it's the only move I got. <laughs> Come on, man. I gotta get my sorry ass back to work. Camp ain't gonna feed itself. Okay. Yeah, it's the only move I got. Still, I tagged your ass with it three times in a row. Oh, fucking shameful. <laughs> Where are we headed? Back to camp. No, no. I still gotta work a shift. Give me a ride up there. It's it's just north of Sherman's camp. Okay. died that night, and there was nothing you or anyone could have done about it. I should have been there. And what good would it's done? Schizo, you there? Lost Lake Camp, Schizo. Yeah, yeah, what's up? We just had a run in with some... Hey, where the hell is you, bro? You skipped work duty today. What the hell, man? Was he... Sh sh shut up and listen to me. I was giving him a ride to the work site, and we were attacked by rippers. Oh, Jesus. Where? Outside of Rogue Camp. You gotta tell Iron Mike. Carlos is coming, and he is not going to stop. What do you think I've been telling him? For months. Yeah, I'll let him know. We're heading toward Tumalo now. Boozer will be at the site in a few minutes. Well, that's great, because he owes the camp another half shift for the work he's missed. Shut up, Schizo. Hey, Deke. Uh, road camp is kind of in the opposite direction of Tumalo, isn't it? We took the scenic route. Out. Asshole. Goddamn Schizo. Come on, you guys. Come on, keep working. Keep at it. We don't work, we don't eat. Right already. That's it. Hey. Thanks for the ride. We all starve. There you go.
Take John to Lost Lake Camp. Come back. Mike, I hear you. Mike. Good. Look, Boozer and I, uh, we just had a run in with Rippers. They. Rippers? God damn it, you boys crossed the Iron Ridge. Deke, I told you. Well, just listen. No, Mike. They were here in Rogue Camp. Rogue Camp? There were Rippers in Rogue Camp? You sure it was Rippers? Am I sure? Oh, Jesus, Mike, yeah. They're kind of hard to miss, you know, with the scars and acting crazy, killing anything that moves. All right, just calm down. Now, we got a parlay with Carlos. Schizo's heading over to Iron Butte tomorrow. He'll find out what the hell's going on, and then we'll... You're sending Schizo to parlay with Carlos. Jesus, Mike. Don't tell me how to run my camp, Deke. Like I said, my treaty is gonna hold. Lost Lake out. Hell, whatever you say, Mike. Whatever you say, Schizo's right. You're gonna get everyone killed.